Hi, welcome to Math Test Prep, where today we're going to answer a standardized math test question where we are asked about creating unique triangles. What is the total number of unique triangles that can be formed with side lengths of 6.5 centimeters, 6 centimeters, and 2.5 centimeters? So the first thing I'm going to do is draw a picture. And I have three sides to my triangle. 2.5 centimeters, 6 centimeters, and 6.5 centimeters that I got from the word problem. So now I need to use what I know about whether or not side lengths could even form a triangle. And that's called the triangle inequality theorem, which states that any two sides of a triangle must be greater than the remaining third. So we have to do three inequalities. We have to say that 2.5 plus 6 is going to be greater than the missing side, the 6.5. So these two sides must be greater when added together than the third side. 2.5 plus 6 is 8.5, and 8.5 is greater than 6.5, so it checks. Now we need to do two more. So let's do these two sides. So these two sides, 2.5 and 6.5, must be greater than that third side, which is 6. 2.5 plus 6.5 is 9, and 9 is greater than 6, so it checks. All right, one more pair to check. We need to add 6 plus 6.5, and it must be greater than the third, which is 2.5. And we can tell 6.5 plus 6 is 12.5, and that is greater than the third side, 2.5. So it checks. So because we are given specific side lengths, then we only can form one unique triangle. Just as a note, if you're only given the three angle measurements, that does not determine the length of the side. So you could form multiple triangles. You would just need to make sure that the three interior angles had a sum of 180 degrees. But if you're given three specific side lengths, you use the triangle inequality theorem to check that any two sides are greater than the third, and then you have one unique triangle.